today I'm at uh, my local downtown area, and uh, this is the uh, March for Our Lives bullshit march. Here we go. March 24th, 2018. This is the uh, anti Second Amendment, anti constitutional March for Our Lives protest rally in the downtown area. So, uh, all potential victims because they want to be uh, defenseless and uh, trust on law enforcement officers to protect their lives when cops are always 10 to 15 minutes late to a sign of a scene of a crime. Anyway, I'm gonna post these people on uh, my uh, YouTube page. I just had to come down here and see exactly what kind of uh, rally this would turn out to be and what kind of uh, turnout I can say it actually would be. So I'm gonna move around a little bit. I'll post this to you guys on YouTube later. But we had drills that we did in case yeah, so, uh, there was one. I remember joking are. with my friends about what would happen when we get a corner to do for our protection and, uh, in our lives if there was a mass shooting. Schools are supposed to be a, a place for education, right growth, friendships, and, uh, and safety. As you can see, schools are not a place for all, mass shootings, death, and fear. Gonna be, uh, but I think it's only really fitting that we remember in that gun violence that happens in schools is tragic, but gun violence that happens in the streets is equally as tragic. The gun violence she talks about in Milwaukee on every day happens to be because of the black thugs that moved up here from Chicago, Illinois. Black people have a tendency to shoot each other on a daily basis in this city now. The white folk here around here, we're still peaceful people. Don't have to really worry about any white people just going crazy and shooting each other on a daily basis. So up here on stage right now, we got this broad, she's black, and she's making this a race issue. Where is the media for our black and brown brothers and sisters? As you can hear, you guys want to be gangbangers, you want to be victims, you want to be violent. All gun reform. So here's people applauding ignorance because they have no common sense of reasoning. Gangbangers will shoot everybody and become a violent act because gangbangers are gangbangers. We want justice. We want justice. She wants justice. Why don't they stop shooting each other? Because that's all they know. 